What is going on guys and girls? My name is James Alfixie and welcome back today to Roblox. How are you doing everyone? Welcome back. Welcome back. Today it is time once again to continue on here with Explorer Simulator and today I'm kind of excited. We've got a few things that I want to do. Uh, as you can see, I... <laughs> Oh, please don't do it again, man. Please. We have the Badger of War, who we uh, we, we kind of got last episode. I may have gone a, a little bit crazy while seeing his beautiful, majestic face. Um, <laughs> so today what I want to do is there's like that new island. Oh, yeah, check this out. I don't know if I've ever seen this, have I? We've got like this cool little map. But uh, last episode we went and explored the volcano and we also went and explored the swamps. So there is this little island here, which I think was called Minnow Island. Uh, which I have yet to explore. So I want to go and do that today. I did actually notice, and I'm not too sure we did last time. Was there this many pets last time? Because I swear that it was just up to the Badger of War. But there seems to be more. And I, I don't know what they are. So I thought we'd go and have a little look here. So we've got Carrot the Parrot, obviously. And we've got the Frog, which is 20% jump power. We've got the Rabbit, 20% sprint. We've got the Turtle who is, is, is also quite a majestic beast. And we've got the Badger of War. But if we go over to this side, we've got the Teddy Bear. Heals you 20 health every 10 seconds, which is pretty good if you want to do some dungeons. Butterfly. Uh, gather rates during the day, 10% up. So pretty good. Uh, bat is 10% at night. The Sloth, <laughs> who is also a very, very majestic beast. A 10% wood gather rate. A lava monster, which is amazing. It reminds me of some kind of Crash Bandicoot something. Uh, gather rate with stone. And then the top pet here is the lemur. 15% gold from chests. Um, we're not going to buy any of those today. I think I'm quite happy with the Badger of War. Uh, they haven't fixed the, the flying thing. He still sort of flies around. I mean, it's just, just, just such a beautiful, beautiful creature, isn't he? Amazing. <laughs> okay, so uh, yeah, what I actually did is I think a couple of days ago or something, I came into the game and I did a little bit of um, meteorite farming. It worked really, really well. And I think we've got, uh, if I open up the list here, oh, it says it at the top, but we've got 22,000 monies. Oh my goodness me. So I'm kind of torn. I don't know which one to buy. Uh, we've got the hot air balloon, which obviously means we can fly and we can go up really high, or we can aff also afford the speedboat which uh, I'm guessing is going to be faster. We can't fly up into the air, but we can get to all the islands super, super quick. So, uh, I mean, the hot air balloon does look really cool. I'm guessing it's going to be something like that. But at the same time, I think the speedboat would actually be really, really awesome. So, um, sh should we give it a go? I mean, well, where would I put it? Should we, uh, uh, um, 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 is, is, do you reckon we could drive it here? Okay, let me try this. So if I do that and I do that, okay, I bought it. So that's 20,000 just gone, but yeah, <laughs> look at this bad boy. Man. Oh, it's gone. There it is. I got a speedboat. Look at this. And I've already got some passengers. All right, dudes. Okay, let's go. So I'm driving. I've, I've, oh, God. <laughs> I've got, I'm at the wheel. <laughs> it's, it's a bit bumpy. I should have put it. I should have put it out in the water, but we're going to make our way over to the other island. Here we go. Here we go. Three, two, one, and da 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 Yeah. <laughs> Look at this. Woo. Right, let's, do some, let's do some circles. Yeah. Okay. This is kind of cool. So much like the, um, the hot air balloon, it does seat three people as well. Um, so let's go over to this new one. Oh. No, no, no. It's not called... Oh, there's a meteor over there. Uh, okay. So it's called Minnow Island. This is the new one. Now, this looks like quite a small island. I haven't been here yet, but what I think it would probably be is, um, come on, come on, come on. Ooh, there's a turtle. Uh, yes. Good parking. Look at that. <laughs> Made to measure. Ooh, there's a turtle. Turtle, turtle. Oh, I put another boat down. Oops. Hang on. No, no, no. Give, give me... Yeah, we got it. Woohoo. It's another item that we need for our little list. Um, so there we go. How much did we get for this? We got 400. Cool. So the next one is 450. All right, so let's go and have a little look around this island. So what I was thinking was, I think the swamp is kind of like, the reason why I like the swamp is because there's a lot of meteor. Ooh. Oh, there's a big hole here. Okay. But yeah, there's a lot of meteor strikes that actually come down on um, the swamp. So that's where I got most of my money from, from just using the, the meteor mining. But I think this one is more for like pickaxe mining because it's got the rocks and stuff. What are you doing? <laughs> What are you doing? Stop giving me your jazz hands. What is this? The Badger of War. His thirst for blood is insatiable. 
Just calm down. Take it down a peg, dude. Take it down a peg. We'll do some fighting in a second. <laughs> oh, man. He's the best pet in the game, isn't he? I hope you guys, if you played this, I hope you go straight for the Badger of War. Don't even buy anything else. Don't even buy a backpack. Don't even buy anything. Just go straight for the Badger of War and you'll be all right. Uh, okay, so I think there's the hole. So we're going to go down that in a second, but let's go and check to see what's available here. So currently we have this one, which is the Sapphire Pickaxe. Um, so I got this because it has the higher gold gather uh, for all of these pickaxes, apart from the diamond, which is pretty pricey. Um, we've got a skeleton just chilling out. Oh, hello, sausage. Okay, we're getting rid of you. And he's down. Okay, cool. Um, and we just got some backpacks. So I think these are the, the same kind of backpacks as before. I mean, part of me would like to do a backpack upgrade next, but it's going to cost us 35,000 gold, which is not cheap, but... Oh, I suppose we're going to have to do it someday, aren't we? Okay, so this is surprising. Is there like a cave system under here? Oh, this is really cool. Okay, let me, let me just sell. Um, so it seems like I thought it was just going to be a small little island, but I'm guessing that from what it seems like, there's like a big underground cave system down here. So shall we, um, shall we follow it and see where it goes? I don't know where, um, don't really know where we're going to end up, but I guess we could... Ooh. Ooh, what's this stuff? It's blue. Is this a new type of ore? Okay, so it's giving me... Oh, it's giving me a little bit of cash. Right, I get it. So usually when you're mining the rocks, it just gives you resources. But with these different colored ones, it gives you resources and it also gives you gold. Gotcha. Okay, cool. Um, so I guess I might as well do a little bit of gathering whilst I'm here because, I mean, it's not very good money. It's like twos each time, but it's better than nothing. And we can also get some resources. I wonder if there's like different cave systems and stuff. Um, I guess we could go and take a look, couldn't we? All right. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Whoop. <gasps> oh, snapperoons. Are you kidding? Okay. Don't just don't die. Whoa! This must be the middle. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! The lava has claimed a victim. Oh my goodness me! So at least we know now that the lava is pretty dangerous. Oh, it's so sad. We saw it right before our very eyes. Oh, I want to get in the middle there so bad. So look at this. There's different colored ores. Um, but there's one in the middle that looks like sort of pure like meteorite or something. How do I get on there? I feel like if I try, it's going to sausage me. <laughs> okay, so let me just have a little look at some of these other ores. We're getting just resources and money. So I think they're kind of the same as the um, as the blue ones that we found. But we are getting the resources and we're also getting the money. I'm dying to see what the middle bit does. How am I going to make that jump, though? It just looks all kinds of perilous. Oh, I wonder if, I wonder if we could cheat the system a bit here. What if we buy... Uh, where was it? I saw this somewhere. No, it wasn't. It wasn't one of these. Uh, oh, what if we had the pet that gave us the 20% jump boost? Should I just go for it? Whoa! Oh, I made it. I made it. I made it. No, <laughs> I was on it for like a second. No, I'm back in the swamps, man. Oh, are you kidding? So, which which one? Hang on, wait a second. Which one was the 20% jump boost? The frog. It's only 2,500. Um, so, what if we... Okay, let's buy the frog. So, does that... Jump power. What is jump power? Does that mean we just jump a bit further? Okay, so I'm going to get the frog. I'm determined to see. I bet it's, like, completely not worth it. But I'm going to go and head back again. And, uh, yeah, we're going to go and try, try and get into the middle bit. I hope the resources are good. They better be. The cool thing is, though, is we've got the speedboat now, so we can take it. Okay, okay. Let's go. Aha! We're back once again. Woohoo! The only problem I've just realized, though, is that I forgot to empty my backpack. <laughs> so uh, we've, 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 like, got 1,500 already. Uh, but I've got my jumping, leaping potion-y thingamajiggy, so let's try this one more time. Whoa! Yes, run, 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 run. Yes! Yes! Look at this special stone! Oh yeah! Look at this bad boy. Okay, let's see. Let's see what it does. Let's see what it. What does it do? Oh, it's not as special as I thought. <laughs> I thought we were gonna get like hundreds from it. 
Okay, we get more resources, but we don't get more money. So I spent 2,500 on this majestic frog, and it doesn't really give us that much more stuff. But, oh, and it runs out really quickly. Oh, are you kidding? <laughs> well, hey, at least we made the jump. Ooh. Yeah, okay, it's much better with the frog. So if you do want to do it yourself, I would highly recommend the frog um, for, for, like, a way to do it. God, look at this place, though. It's mad. I like it. I like it. I like it. So this must be the only thing that's kind of in this little area, I'm guessing. Uh, the cool thing is, though, is we did actually manage to find it. So that's good. Um, okay, so uh, I, I don't really know what we should do now, really. I mean, the thing is, there's a lot of, like, these hidden items that are kind of, like, chilling around the map. But we don't really have that many of them. So it would be quite cool to find some. But I also did see this here as well. Now, you can actually sell treasure maps. Oh, shows the locations of chests and tubes. No, 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 no. I thought it was like a special treasure map or something. Um, I suppose what we could do is we could actually go into a tomb. Maybe we should find a tomb. We've got like... How many people are sort of here? One, two... I swear there was three. Uh, we could maybe go and do some tomb raiding. Okay, dokie. So, uh, yeah, we've headed back to the swamp here. Because I think, well, it might be kind of good to, um, to do a tomb. Especially because, like, we've got a couple of... People? Oh, they must have saved. <laughs> they must have saved over their hopes. I didn't. I, I always forget to use the checkpoints. So, like, if there's one checkpoint, I always just use the same one. It's kind of bad. Like, I should probably start checkpointing myself a bit more close to where we actually are. But uh, last time I came and did some resource gathering, I did actually see that there were quite a few tombs in and around the swamp area. Um, so. Having said that, I'm not seeing any of them right now, which is a little bit annoying. Um, but, I don't know. Let's see if we can find a tomb. See, the thing is, if there's, like, more than one person, then the tombs are a little bit easier. And um, I'm wondering if we could actually find maybe, like, an extreme tomb or something. It could actually be quite fun. Um, so, I, I guess, like, you can bring more than one, per like, person down into a tomb. Should we try it? Okay, we got one. We got a small, hard tomb. Three, two, one, and go, 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 go. Yeah. Oh, God, everyone's falling over. No. <laughs> We're off to a bad start, lads. All right, let's go and do some tomb braiding. Let's see what we can do, lads. Um, I don't know which way everyone's going. Should we just should we just go mad? Let's go mad. Whoa. All right, so hopefully the, the skeletons and stuff should be a little bit easier to take down. Yeah, look at this. Oh, it's so much easier with more people. I was like tomb raiding solo. Oh, okay. Let me, let me help you out there, dude. Oh god, no! Don't donate. Now's not the time to donate. Okay, there we go. Um, but yeah, I was doing it by myself, and I think I did an extreme tomb by myself. But the cool thing about the if you do it solo, is that there are some areas with like big holes in, and um, you can like lure the skeletons and stuff, and you can uh, drop them down the holes, which is one way of doing it if you are rolling solo. I am not even going to attempt that jump because I know exactly what's going to happen. <laughs> All right, so this is only a small tomb. Oh god, not these. Does anyone know how to do these? Oh, 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 it's been done. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's a mystical chest. Yes, lads. Come on, come on, come on. Everyone, we've got to share it. We've got to share it. All right, let's go. Okay, stop hitting that donate button. That's really annoying. Why does it keep popping up? Okay, so let's uh, let's let's try and do some work here on these skeletons. Uh, let's try and keep the skeletons down if we can. Because the, the, the mystical chests are really, really good. But, of course, there's loads of mobs. So I'm going to try and slay the uh, skeletons with the badger of war. Whilst people try and get the, the money. Because, you know, you've got, you got to be a team player sometimes. You know what I mean? There we go. Okay, nice. Come on, everyone. Go, go and get the money. Go and get the money. Come on, we can do this. <laughs> oh, wow. So, why does it keep doing that? What am I clicking to make it donate? I have no idea. There we go. Share the money. Share the wealth. Woohoo. Okay, that's actually really annoying. I don't know why that keeps popping up. Yeah. <laughs> Good job, guys. Good job. I had no idea that there was, like, the crazy good chest behind these stupid puzzles, which I can't do because it's just, it's just, well, it was explained to me just now. I still, I still don't know what I'm doing. All right, awesome. So we did manage to get the small chest, which is good. This is only technically a small tomb. Oh, but there's another layer. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. Should we go up? Whoa. Okay, big chest. Okay. Oh, got it fallen down. All right, okay. Well, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, it's another chest rumbled. Let's keep rolling deep, lads. Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. Dun, dun, dun. This is just a small little ditty one in here. There's nothing special. We'll get rid of it if we need to. Um, I think... I'm so confused. Oh, I get the donate button now. Oh, now I understand. So I was thinking, like, maybe I was clicking something at the side. But if you actually click on an individual player... Then you can send them a donation. Right, gotcha. You have to play for longer to be able to donate. Oh, okay. 
Now I get it. I thought I was like clicking a button or something and I was really confused, but I didn't realize you could individually. Oh God. <laughs> All right, guys, <laughs> you, you know what to do. I'm just going to stand here and watch. And uh, yeah, we, we can go for it. Oh, would it be another legendary chest? I assume they're called legendary chests. I don't know, but they look fancy. All right, okay, I'm just going to watch. I'm going to let I'm gonna let the clever people do the puzzles, and then I'm going to come in with the Badger of War, steaming in with my machete. I'm going to do some work. Hey, two for two. Good job, guys. Oh, it's just a big one, but okay. It doesn't matter. We can, we can, still, we can still do some work here. Um, so I'll tell you what, I'm going to try and focus mainly on the skeletons, just because I've got a decent machete. Um, so I can kind of help out a bit like that, I guess. Um... So I think, I don't know, this is actually quite a big dungeon. I mean, they said it was a small one, but to be honest, it's actually got quite a few runes. Look at this. Go, guys, go, go, go. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> oh, the dungeons are so much more fun with, like, people. Yeah, they're really fun. I like them a lot. Okay, Um, I think we're done. I think we did it. Yeah. Okie dokies. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I think that is going to be about it for today's video. Uh, I did just go and look to see if I can find one of the extreme tombs. Um, but yeah, I, I, I tried to find one on this island. I didn't find one. So hopefully, uh, the next time we play... If we can get a gang together like this, then uh, we can go and do some more, um, we can go and do some more raiding. But that was really fun. That was like our first sort of party raid, I guess. And, um, we also went to the Minnow Island and we discovered like the, uh, the underground bit with the, uh, the crazy dangerous lava pool of death. But I think all in all, a pretty successful trip. So, uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, then please remember to poke me in that like button. And if you're not yet subscribed, go for it because we do Roblox done fun. But until next time. Thank you once again for watching. It's been such a pleasure. As always, thanks. Rantio!